Hey team, welcome to another video. Today we're going to be talking about how to get the item level 510 botanist hatchet, also known as the sky builders hatchet. This is a series of relic weapons that have been released in 5.45. We did the Fisher one yesterday. So if you want to know how to do that one, go watch that video. And here goes the fourth try of making this video. Pinnacle of the gathering relics that was dumb you're gonna need uh, i don't i don't like this at all i don't like this at all fuck dude this is so complex the recent patch 5.45 nope that's terrible all right the reason this has been so difficult is because it's it's insanely complex and gets very rambly when i try to explain it so i'm try to make it as just simple as I possibly can. In order to get the hatchet, you're gonna need to collect some feathers from Azasla, and you're gonna need to collect some birch logs from the diadem. So we're gonna start with the diadem. I'm gonna show you exactly what to do. Oh, and you if you need to know where to start the quest in order to get the relics, if it's your first one, go to Sky Steel Manufactory. You'll have an available quest if you've done the ones, the levels beforehand. Otherwise, just go to Firmament 9.5 by 14.5, which is where I just was. Sorry, I forgot to mention that, mention that at the top. All right, so we're gonna go into Diadem. And we are going to go to 27 by 15. The island that is 27 by 15, which is this one right here. It's about 26, 27 by 15. So it's this island on the right. So let's fly over there real quick on our... Ooh, and dust storms up. If I wasn't making this video, I'd be going after some dirt leaves. The dirt leaves, at least on my server, are still selling for like six to eight hundred a piece. I was out here getting some of these logs earlier, and when the weather would change, I'd just go and grab whatever was up, make a little bit of extra gill. As people are trying to catch up, those uh, those items sell pretty well. Alright, so once you get to this island, just look for the closest gathering point. There's going to be three of them, and you're going to need high quality. So when I click on one, obviously use whatever you can to get your high quality capability up. You know, use whatever abilities you like. You are going to need to gather, for this part of it, 750 oddly delicate birch logs. Once you have 750 oddly delicate birch logs, you will be able to trade those into Spanner, where we just were in the firmament, for the 25 inconceivably delicate hatchet parts you need for the relic hatchet. Hopefully that makes sense. But just know you're gonna need 750 of these logs that I just brought you to in order to complete the relic. The next place we're gonna go is Azasla, so I will meet you there in just a second. Here in Azasla, we are going to be looking for some feathers, and they can be found at. Uh, 11 by 26.5 if you go to 11 by 26.5 you'll be right in the middle of all the gathering points and it's actually on the um the northern tip of the same island we were at for the fisher My 
My elders beats your dragon. Bruh. All right. We're going to head over one of these trees. And you'll see the oddly delicate feather. Now, I can't give you a root number of how many of these you're going to need to get because there's this crazy little mini game that you kind of play through in order to determine the quality. It can get pretty complex, but here's what I would recommend just to quickly knock it out. All right? So you're going to click on the feather. It's going to pull up this little box that's going to help you improve your quality. And if you remember the lowest quality that we could get in order to get something is 400. So we need it at least 400, but if we can, we want to get all the way to a thousand. 400 will give us one pot of the oddly delicate hatchet parts that we need. A thousand will give us seven pots of the hatchet parts. And you need to get to a total of 250. So just to recap, we need 750 high quality logs from Diadem in order to get the 25 pots of hatchet parts and we need to play this little feather quality game to get the 250 pots of the other hatchet parts. So hopefully you're all caught up now. All right, so here's what I do. If I have GP, I just click this scrutiny at the bottom and then you can just start playing with these three. The one on the far right here has a lower improvement to quality but there's a chance that it won't use up any of the four steps that you have all right this one here is my favorite it's the big gambling one so you can see there's a range it's either going to give you a little bit or it's going to give you a lot of it and then this one on the far left is the boring one but it gives you a guaranteed amount so i'm going to gamble and see how we do so right now we're at 396 and we've got three out of four more steps that we can do let's try another one now here's here are the numbers you want to know 400 gets you one 700 gets you three a thousand gets you seven right so if i collect the two that i have left and i get one each i'm going to get two for that right but if I can get it to 700 then I'll get three so I'm gonna check Ooh, that's only gonna get me to 687 that could get me there that's only gonna get me to 638 I'm just gonna grab these right so you hit collect and you just kind of farm them as normal if you want kind of just a quick and dirty way to do it Here's what you do. Just click on it, click on the feather. If you have the GP, hit this, start gambling. And just keep going until you've done two. Take a look at kind of where you're at and what you can get to. Here I can get to 758 for sure. So I'm gonna do that in order to get the three. And then I'm gonna collect, right? I'm sure there's probably better ways to do this, maybe, but I just, you know, I don't feel like using my brain to spend a bunch of time figuring it out. So again, I'm just gonna click on it. I've got the GP left. So I'm gonna click on this and then I'm gonna start gambling. I'm gonna hit one, I'm gonna hit two, and let's see, I'm at 673. I can get to 867 or I can, nah, I'm not gonna be able to get the whole thing. So I'm just gonna guarantee get over seven and go ahead and collect that. That's gonna get me three. And again, you wanna get to 250 total. I'm gonna click on the feather. I've got the GP. If you don't, just start gambling, right? This just gives you a little bit of a boost. That was a pretty good swing. I would really like to be able to show, doesn't look like it's gonna happen though. I'd like to be able to show getting a thousand, which is pretty cool. That gives you seven, which is nice. All right, so anyway, that's the game. 
and then if I want to head back to foundation just the last little bit I'll show you turning them in and then I'll, I'll set you free please let me know if I can help with this any more in the comments this one the fishing was way more straightforward but once you kind of figure out the parts that you need and stuff you'll be fine so again you go to the spanner guy i'm going to start with the delicate materials which is the feathers right so i've got one 867 i trade that in i get three so I'm gonna trade these in, trade these in, trade these in, trade these in, with the goal of getting to 250 oddly delicate hatchet parts. Then I'm gonna go and I'm gonna trade in some of the logs. They go in stacks of 30, with the, and those are from the diadem with the goal of getting to 25 inconceivably delicate hatchet parts. Once you have all of that, take the hatchet that you have equipped, switch it out for something else, go talk to Emini and get your relic. Thanks for watching the video. Have a great one and we'll see you in the next one. Bye team.